So Charlie, you have a wedding coming up next month. That's right, yeah, end of April. Are it's, you ready? Yes, I, I mean, people like are like, oh, how's it going? And, and, you know, of course I'm excited, but I didn't really do any of the work. I can't take any of the credit You're for how gonna great it's going to be. Um, my beautiful fiance, Tana, did all of the hard work, and she's creative and, um, you know, I great at planning. She mentioned she's also a, a skater. Former. And yeah, she's, and she's on the tour with us. Okay. Yeah, um, yeah which, is, which has made my life so much easier, you know, touring and, and so, doing So what, you're not going to compete anymore. You've won the Olympics. You won everything you can, but you'll skate together in the future? You know, we haven't decided not to compete. Uh, oh, I'm we've, sorry. I jumped that's the okay. gun on that. No, yeah we've, yeah, we've decided not to compete. We didn't compete this year, and we've yes. decided not to compete this upcoming competitive season. Okay. Uh, but we haven't officially decided about the next Winter Olympics. So we'll see. And, I mean, in the meantime, how lucky that we're a part of a sport that is also very performance-based, yeah, and right. we can do shows like Stars on Ice. Yeah. Now, in terms of skating at the Olympics again, I mean, if... It's a huge commitment. It is. Huge, yeah. Skating on ice is wonderful, and you work hard, but it's nothing like getting ready for the Olympics. No, right. no of course. <laughs> yeah, that, and, and that's part of you know, the equation. It's just you have to be so hungry to, to get up at you know, 5 a.m. and go into the rink all day and work until you're exhausted, and, and you have to sacrifice a lot. And here's another thing. You skated in Vancouver. You were thrilled to be there. You mm -hmm. were thrilled to medal it all. You go to Sochi, you got to win it. Right. Yeah. For you, the burden, if you think of going again is winning or nothing, right? Yeah, yeah. I Your mean. expectations are just completely different now. Yeah, you know, it's interesting. We, we keep saying that if we do decide to return to the Olympics, we would need a real reason to be there with every fiber of our being because we knew going into Sochi that we were going to give it everything that we had 24 hours a day, seven days a week, and that's why it worked for us. We were willing to put everything into it. You know, it's nice looking at the two of you because you're, you're both such nice, sweet people, mm -hmm. but you're killers. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Don't tell anyone. <laughs> <laughs> Inside, you're killers. As soon as you get on the ice. Yeah. Yeah. Different Absolutely. Person. Yeah, I mean, it's just a competitive, it's just a competitive nature that um, we always enjoyed. Um, you know, going to the rink and, and being able to compete, but also it, it comes in practice every day, and that's what some people, you know, who watch the Olympics, they think it just kind of happens for right. you, or it's, it doesn't. Oh, they had a nice performance. It's every there, single yeah. day in practice, and, and we were able to enjoy that, and, and that's know, what made uh, the difference. Knowing in the Olympics, you only have a few seconds, so oh. if you blow this, yeah. it's all over, right? Man, stress All right, me 2015 out. Uh, Dancing uh, Stars on Ice, pardon me, Dancing for Joy, uh, tour uh, skates into the Honda Center this Saturday. It's always great to see you guys. Thank and you. Thanks for having us. Thank you. 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 Thank you.